Hey guys, it's Kyle back again. <laughs> Just jacking up the back axis so we can put the tank back in. Is this day six? Day five. I thought you guys worked on it. Yeah, that was day four. Yeah, it was day four. Okay. Day five of the Bronco. Day five, Bronco project. Got a new tank. You have to do test some drive, right? 34 gone. She has a test, then I have a test. It's coming along, guys. So one of us always the test. Looks pretty sweet. We're way excited. We'll keep you guys updated. We're gonna video today on everything. Yes. All right, guys. We're painting right here, or I'll show you what happened on the gas tank. This came off of an 82 gas tank, which was a 25. If you can see, had two wires. That's two inches. This is three and a half and has four wires. So it's not gonna fit, so we have to figure out what's going on. So we're gonna call some people tomorrow. So we're not worried about that gas tank right now. We're gonna do that tomorrow. I'm on the side though. Try to do it right here, girl. Sure. It's all got to be painted. Well, guys, D slapped it hard. Painted the exhaust pipe. I think it looks great. Take a <laughs> <laughs> Jet black. <laughs> there you go. I missed some. Did you not do your mouth? Painted our hitch because it needed to be painted. And D went to the exhaust. Yeah, I saw you go for the gas tank. What was that idea? Never did that. Right here, he did, just embarrassed. There's what we got with that. We're gonna throw the grill and see what it looks like. Gotta just touch Come it. around, we're gonna grind all of that off. Dude, Grandpa, how come this is so hard? The exhaust pipe. Take off. Did that. Tank's going in next time. We're gonna throw that grill on. Looking good. I'll just clean those out. <clears throat> Jack just grinded off some stuff off the side. I think it was right there. Alright guys, just chilling in the seat right now. We're gonna go over some stuff. That's how you pop the hood in these old vehicles. Brights. Windshield wipers. These are for the lights on top. And these are all, we figured out, these are all the check engine lights. I'm missing some. Comment down below if you know what that is. Um, got our gauges. Radio. Yeah. AC. No, I actually took it back down. Jack yep. donated some floor mats. What were these it out came of? out of my old truck. <laughs> I bought me some RAM floor mats. And a yak. Sorry. That is not funny. Girls on the phone. Jack fixed this door. I meant the mirror. Put those on. Put that one on. Cup. Can, can I show them our scent holder? Old classic Bronco scent holder. Is that cool or what? But it doesn't really hold a lot. It's all can really fit. There's nothing wrong with that. Oh, our 
Jack grinded these off. Got a little bit. There's nothing wrong with that. We'll get some cool stickers. We'll have extreme yeah. contrast. Thanks for watching this episode of the Bronco. Um, this was part four and five. But just coming along good. We'll do a little recap. The only fatalities we have today were we were cutting on something and I touched it with my fingers and it burnt me pretty good. Spray painting that, put the grill back on. Spray painting under the grill. If you'll come around the back with me. My friend Yak, he he grinded some of these bolts. I put this in. Got new floor mats now that came out of my Dodge truck. Yeah, what a disaster in that bad boy. Gas tanks here, this is a gallon. 33 gallon tank. Spray painted the exhaust pipe. I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, put down in the comments below what you guys think of this. This was a Dallin idea. Me and Kyle were not involved. But Kyle, um, you have any words to say about Dallin's mechanic skills? They suck, but he's decent. <laughs> Do you have any skills to sell about Kyle? Alright guys, so thanks for watching this episode. The next one will be up by the end of this week. The Ford Bronco rebuild is coming along. Once she's running, comment down below if you want to ride.